so you have a bunch of small audio files like your scanner files from ProScan that you want to take and make into one large file. The easiest way to do that is to go to the folder uh, where you're recording them and go, go to the audio files that you want uh, for one particular incident or whatever. Uh, I'm going to go back here, find one incident. I can usually see the timestamps from 9.58 to 12.55, so that's where that incident started. I'll highlight them all. I'm going to copy them. I'm going to put that in a new folder, so I'm going to right-click, New Folder. Open that up, paste them in there. There they all are, being copied into there. I can look, see, they're all there. Now, Windows 10, I can just come up here and go File, Option, or File, Open Command Prompt, and open that right there, and there it is. Uh, if you're not using Windows 8 or Windows 10, you won't have that. In Windows 7, you can just close the folder, come to it, hold down Shift, and right-click, and that will give you the option right here, Open Command Window here. So if you just do a regular right click, you'll see it's not there. But if you hold down shift and do your right click, you will, you'll have open command window here. So we do that. And if we, uh, if we were to do D DIR directory, that'll show us that all those files are in there that we copied. So what we'll do is we'll, we'll say copy, C-O-P-Y space forward slash uh, here's a tip for Windows uh, you do forward slash question mark that'll show you all your extra parameters that you could use and there they are the one we're going to use is the slash B which indicates a binary file so what I'm going to do once again I'm going to hit the directory so we're looking at that we're going to go copy copy forward slash B and then I'm going to do the wild card, which is the asterisk, which is shift 8 dot mp3. Um, we can see that these are all mp3 files. If you add WAV files, you'd want to do DA or WAV. Um, whatever, whatever way you're recording, you're going to want to use the extension for, uh, for that. So this is saying copy in a binary format all the files that end with .mp3 so that's going to get all of our, our files the next thing we need to do is hit space and then give it a name so we'll go test 123.mp3 and I'm going to hit enter boom it did that we go to the folder where it's at uh, we'll look at the bottom here and there it is there's all the files. Good to go. You double click on that. Winamp will open that up. It'll show it's a 5 minutes and 22 second file made out of them all. Anyway, that's uh, as simple as it gets.